People have got to be on their toes to keep up when we're in the room, as a lot of you have probably experienced. Our bond has only grown closer over the years as we have grown into the women we are today. When Jenny decided to plant her roots up in Boston, it was a hard pill for us to swallow. But as we see this happy little family growing before our eyes, we can only hope that we will be blessed with similar futures. Virginia, you have constantly been a supportive cousin and friend, and now we watch in awe as you add mother and wife into your long list of blessings. Patrick, it's not easy to get in with the four of us. Congratulations on being the first initiated, and welcome to the club. This morning, Virginia was just kind of like hanging out, and over the past hour, she started coloring in the coloring book, <laughs> because I think that that's just sort of like a relaxer for her, but she's been very mellow all morning long. I think she's kind of just like ready for the rest of the day to happen. Everyone's really excited. It's been a long day coming. Jenny and Patrick love each other so much, so it's finally here. When I first knew it was serious is when I got a call over Christmas vacation about two in the morning that said, I won't be home tonight because I'm in New York headed for Maryland to see Jenny. She met Patrick when she was a just going into her sophomore year of college and one weekend I can remember Jenny being at the house and she said mom I think we've got a problem and I said what's that well I think Patrick's coming down here <laughs> driving down all the way <laughs> and he did <laughs> that was really nice we had been dating for like a few months at that point he tries to downplay it and say it's not a big deal but it was because I could tell at that point that somebody that I really, really cared about and really liked felt the same about me and that just meant the world. I knew that this guy was special. At Thanksgiving or whatever time, he would send me flowers. Pete would say, I he's think bucking he's for bucking son for son-in-law. <laughs> <laughs> Who presents Virginia to be married to Patrick? Her mother and I. He kind of makes Virginia loosen up from time to time. He'll push her buttons and make her realize that life is about joking and having fun. And then she'll kind of remind him that, you know, every now and then it's, it's nice to just be sweet to the one you love. So they're, they're funny to watch with each other. You like to kiss me? Do that for the video. <laughs> You're the best big brother I can ask for. And I wish you two best of luck in your new adventure together. I guess this is where I'm supposed to give you guys some type of advice. Whenever you're wrong, admit it. Whenever you're right, shut up. They've been together and for quite a while now, and I just remember the first time meeting Patrick. He totally like rolls with the punches. I think his sarcasm can definitely lighten the mood. He's like a perfect compliment. They're just great together. Patrick, do you love Virginia and want to be her husband? I do. Virginia, do you love Patrick and want to be his wife? I do. For about a half a year or a semester, he was studying abroad in Italy, and that was kind of stressful on the relationship. I think that it took him going away to realize that it doesn't matter what complete opposites, that we need each other in each other's lives. It was tough, it was very, very hard, and we broke up for a short period of time after he got back, but I honestly don't think we'd be here if he didn't go. Virginia, I choose you <laughs> to be my wife. He sent me an email at the time, he said, I'd like to come down and talk to you and Kay. Had lunch with us. You know, and he says, well, you're probably wondering why I'm here. <laughs> so we, we kind of figured it out. <laughs> and then he asked us for our daughter's hand. And of course, we were thrilled. Patrick, I choose to, you to be my husband. I choose you to be my husband. We went to Rockport, Mass, and we took her out on the rocks. We were walking along the kind of like a little cliff area, and there were people all around. Finally, enough people left. I said, let's take a picture, and then we'll go get something to eat. So I set up my camera, and I ran over, took a picture with her, and got down on one knee and proposed. And the, the whole back is the sunset and everything. So it was all, all chance, but it worked out well. So you can kiss the bride, and we can applaud. How about Woo! that? I had a hard time keeping it a secret. And so when Virginia called and, and said to us, I'm engaged, and I said, I know. <laughs> <laughs> and she said, how did you know? <laughs> so for the first time, I'd like you to greet uh, Mr. and Mrs. Patrick and Virginia Bevington.
again, heartbeat again, heartbeat again. There you go, making me feel like a kid. Won't you do it and do it one time? I've seen them over the years go from being complete opposites to the exact same person. They've both changed each other for the better, and I hope that they stay happy and they remember that they've got their family. Everybody's always there for them. I wish them the absolute best to their family, to everyone, for a perfect day today. You just couldn't do it any other way. It's real love, it's real family, and so we're having a real wedding. Being a family of three, it's great. It's nice to have Fia here. It's an added bonus. It's a great day nonetheless, but having her here is even better. Today is a day about love. You're getting married. You're committing yourself to one another forever, and having Fia there is just a part of both of them. It's absolutely beautiful. Love you guys. <laughs> Wish them joy in the future and a lovely life together. We know they're going to have a great life together. We wish them the best. You guys are awesome. We love you. We just hope to have a happy and healthy life together. Just to see the two of them, you know, finally be married and be together. I wish them the best for a long, long marriage. We couldn't be more happy for the two of you and to watch you build your lives together. So, here's to Patrick and Virginia. May you have a long life of happiness, love, and of course, laughter. We love you guys. Cheers.